We're going to factor x cubed minus 15x squared plus 56x. And what we can do first, since each of those terms has an x in it, we can factor that out. So we can rewrite this as x times x squared minus 15x plus 56. So now we're going to factor our part inside the parentheses, and since our leading coefficient there is 1, then we can think of two numbers that multiply to give 56. So we've got 8 times 7 gives us 56, and then when we add 8 and 7, that gives us positive 15. So these numbers don't work because we're looking for a negative 15 since that's our middle term. But negative 8 times negative 7 also gives positive 56. And when we add those numbers together, we do in fact get negative 15. So now we can rewrite our x cubed minus 15x squared plus 56x as x, since we factored that out in the beginning, and that'll be times x plus something times x plus something else. And we're going to use the two numbers that we just found. So our final answer will be x times x minus 8 times x minus 7.